Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. My name is Wendy and this is my mobile home sweet home. Uh, today, I thought I would bring you along with me as I did a little bit of work in my kitchen. I think I had shown you guys uh, right after I'd gotten it, but I got this little dishwasher, this little countertop dishwasher at Christmas time. And I, I think I had talked about it and shown it to you, but I've gotten really good at loading it. <laughs> it's not very big, so it's kind of... Um, you kind of have to do the Tetris thing <laughs> to get everything in there if you have kind of a lot. Which, just being one person, I don't. But it um, actually holds quite a bit. So I thought that while I was doing my dishes today, I'd just bring you along for a little house cleaning video. I know I don't do this very often, but I'm not sure why. But I guess I don't ever want anyone to see when my house is a mess. <laughs> But anyway, oh, and also, by the way, I want to thank each and every one of you that prayed for my daughter during her illness. She's still not 100%, but she is feeling a bit better. So thank you from the bottom of my heart for praying for her. That means the world to me. You know how if you're a mama, you know what it feels like when one of your babies is sick. And especially when it is your baby. <laughs> she is my youngest. And even though she's oh, 36 years old, <laughs> it doesn't, you know, I, I tell her in my head, you're still two. So when you get sick, I get really worried. <laughs> but she really was very, very sick. Um, her... Uh, boyfriend took her to the emergency room she was having severe stomach cramping and they did uh, a cat scan or yeah a cat scan uh, to rule out horrible things I'm sure but that came back clear so they just said she had a severe intestinal infection so that's quite a thing to fight off so I told her you're not gonna just jump back you know, in three days, it's going to take your body a bit to fight this off. But um, they did give her some really strong antibiotics. But uh, and tomorrow is the last day for those antibiotics. So hopefully she's, you know, well on the road to recovery. And they'll be here in a couple weeks for another visit. So I'm really looking forward to that. But I do want to thank you guys so very much for um, I had put a community post up if you any of you that didn't see it and, and requested prayer. And the, for those of you that responded, I thank you most sincerely. Thank you. Anyway, that's enough of that. So let's get this dishwasher loaded. <laughs> myself today thinking how I changed how I really don't care if you are here or if you don't stay now I'm feeling those winter blues but I don't want to cry Cause all we ever do is laugh it off and I'm sick and I don't know why you remember that night we met I thought you looked so fine I guess we have to agree to disagree For this one last time Pretty weird that day when we did not exchange our hellos I wasn't looking out for you I'm sorry, I'm so shallow I'm still looking forward to watching part two of Deathly Hallows with you.
care if I got much at all Here in this small town Cause in the end we're all buried deep inside the same hole in the ground Not much to do when all I can is thinking about you. Not doing well. Don't know where you are. Cause you're not here. It's been way too long. If I could lay down beside you, I would. That's all I wanna do I hope that you are safe and that I will see you soon If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would I would, I would, I would. We talk on the phone Every night Love to hear your voice Not sleeping well And I know that you're right But you should know it You've been gone for way too long now If I can lay down beside you I would, I would When nothing really matters That's all I want All I know, what I need, and that ain't changing and Even if you're gone, I will remember you All I know, what I need, and that ain't changing If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would When nothing really matters, that's all I wanna do I hope that you are safe and that I will see you soon If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would When nothing really matters, that's all I wanna do I hope that you are safe and that I will see you soon
And that's pretty much it for filling this little dishwasher, but it just works out so good for me. If you're just one person, it's definitely worth it. It um, I didn't have very much in there today or this evening, but um, I can get a lot more in there than that. The, the plates, you have to lay them down kind of because they're too tall, and then the top <clears throat> washing arm or whatever you call it, can't spin around. There's one on the top and on the bottom, and it does a fantastic job of washing the dishes, just as a full-size dishwasher does. The only difference is it doesn't have a heating element for the drying process, but what it does is it has a fan in there, and once it's all done washing, then that fan goes on for however long I've never timed it but and it gets them pretty dry they're not completely dry but um, I just have to give them a quick wipe with the dish towel sometimes certain things when I take them out and it's fine but I as you can see I fill it by hand it takes about three and a half pitchers this pitcher came with it along with this trough and you know, clearly that sits on the top and you you have to turn it on and then you fill it and it will beep at you when it's full, when it's reached the, the amount it needs to do a cycle. And um, I have it set up that way because I can't have it right next to my sink. I My cupboard sits way too low, as you can see. And um, so, but what I did was, I'll see if I can show you. What I did was I, okay, let me hold on a second here. Let me lower this down a little bit. As you can see in my sink, <laughs> okay, Wendy, in the sink, I have this hose right here. This is the drain hose, and it just runs along the back of the counter along back behind in there I'm sorry you can't really see it but you get the idea and so that way um, I just fill it by hand and then that drain hose just it's never in the way it's totally out of the way and I just have it in the sink here and it just works out so easy they do when you buy it they do include the hose that you can actually hook it up to your sink and fill it that way if you so choose but like I said I'm not set up you know for that because my upper cupboards come down too low so it can't sit right next to my sink and quite frankly I don't really think I would have wanted it to but because I just don't have that much counter space that <laughs> luckily that the thing that it sits on is uh it was here when I bought this house it's an extra it's like a butcher block thing and it's got four drawers in it and it butts right up against the, the cupboard so it's like you know extra space but it worked out just perfect to set that dishwasher on so it worked out really good and I am very very pleased with it that was probably one of the best things I've ever bought for my house really really happy with that dishwasher so they can be kind of expensive but I had my eye on this particular one and it happened to be on sale at the time so it worked out great but this round it runs about th they run about 300 bucks and up you can clearly you can you know spend more um, but this one had excellent reviews it's the brand of it is a comfy it's c-o-m-f-e-e -E. And I did purchase it on Amazon and uh, just thrilled to have it. It's really, really helped me out a lot. I've gotten a little spoiled <laughs> not having to wash dishes for the first time in, gosh, years. I haven't had a dishwasher in a long, long time. So I just never thought I'd really care about it, but I'm really glad to have it. So, yeah, and I just keep these under my sink and everything's tucked out of sight. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that little bit of a house cleaning video. 
I know it wasn't really much. It's not a super long video, but anyway, I mainly just wanted to get on here and thank you guys so much for praying for my daughter. I appreciate you guys so much. You always say the kindest things to me in your comments, and I really appreciate that, and I just love you all to pieces. <laughs> So God bless you guys, and thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.